Hi my beautiful cancer, welcome to my channel. That is of light 1111. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. This reading is for my lovely cancer, sun, moon, rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe, universal energies, ancestors, spirit, die, archangels, ascended masters, please my lovely cancer. And please be safe on this message for the highest good. Well, cancer, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit the like, the subscribe button, the notification bell below. If you are returning subscribers, welcome back. I do appreciate each and every one of you that are supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful. I'm sending lots of love, no beginning, and prosperity your way. Energies are fluid. This reading may or may not resonate with you. If it's not resonate, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So, my lovely Cancerian, let's see what's going on for you. In your love life or oh, anything else for that matter we have spiritual lesson this person in is in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson oh jeez here we go again with this lesson <laughs> um i'm going to say this to you be careful someone might be coming towards you because this is at the bottom so someone might be coming towards you guys financial challenges are affecting this connection so someone coming towards you they might be teaching you a lesson um someone in here this is what i'm getting for you in advance i'm going to telling you this lesson here is not as bad as you think someone in here might be going through financial setback they excuse me guys they might be provide this person might be providing everything else except they don't have um they don't have the same amount of money you have so if you know what i mean that's the that's the uh, lesson here so you guys going to have to figure this out you know um they might be doing everything i'm getting in energy someone is going to do everything in their power to be with you except that when it's come to the money they might not bringing this amount of money you bring so mm. give me one card please for cancer spirit two cards so we have awakening absolutely so you are awakening just like i've already said someone is undergoing a spiritual transformation so it's look like for some of you cancer you are awakened to this so you're gonna know what to do so that's good whatever this lesson i feel like whatever this test you're gonna pass with flying colors give me one more card for cancer here and now your true love is already part of your life so someone in here that's coming towards you it might be a true love that's coming i'm getting here and now it's like someone that is coming but like i said they, they might not have the finance you expected so you're gonna you might have to pass the test because i feel like for some of you if you pass the test you and this person are going to be um like beyond happy together even if they don't have a lot of money but they are going to give you whatever they have so give me two cards please, for this person that coming towards cancer yeah master you see you have learned a spiritual lesson i'm telling you there's some type of lesson here this person is going to t teach you whomever this is that's coming towards you so you're gonna have to you know give me one more card please, for this person for the person doesn't have to be one person decision it's time to decide about this relationship wow so if you're if you are past the test you and this person might be staying together but if you know if one of you failed the test that you this relationship is going to go bye bye that's what i'm getting intuition you already know the answer you seek so you're gonna have to because you awaken cancer so you're gonna have to use your intuition oh i hate those tests lord of mercy the universe is testing you especially after my google which were great after the energy we have here they still test good lord give me one card please for cancer i'm sorry guys trust but the universe is telling you what to do here the situation is calling for you to have faith they're calling you to trust this but you might not to especially that if you feel like this person doesn't have the money you make give me one card for this person's friend. separation 
time apart from your partner is on the horizon this person might just went through a separation a divorce something like that so they might not have that kind of money because they have to pay for whatever they got going on in their lives forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past you experience more love in your present moment so this person there might want to go separation or there's a separation that's coming through spirit who's coming towards cancer who's coming towards cancer oh whoever that's coming towards you this person might be defensive they might be very guarded or this person might also someone in here that i felt like there might be also a lot of people black from you that's what i'm getting here who's coming towards cancer might be a lot of people that blacks from you yeah if we have the death card that's coming kind of sideways as a challenge so i feel like you know whomever this person here that's coming towards you they might need to change they might have been hard time changing they might need to um they might need to end something here in order they might need to transform then they need to be a better person in order for them to come so with you because there's some type of blockages here so i feel like spirit might be doing your favor also helping you for so seven of ones seven of ones if they are not defensive very guarded very protective this is this is um a spiritual warning so yeah nine of swords someone in here is might be having sleepless night anxiety stress for whatever reason here because they haven't changed whatever they are trying to do here i'm getting someone that hasn't changed so you don't have to know this person per se okay so we show me this person current energy yeah they're not this person is not balanced we have Sagittarius energy, Scorpio energy here, Major Arcana. But this person is unbalanced. Show me this person's current energy. So that's what Spirit say to trust. So when they say to trust this situation here, they're talking about you to trust yourself. That's what they say here. Yeah, Six of Cups, someone from the past. Mm. This person hasn't changed. They are in their head. You know, this is this person current energy. Someone in here is in their head. They are unbalanced. Six of Cups. Something, you know, mm, know what to say to you. What is this person want cancer to know, Spirit? What do they want cancer to know? I am the Emperor. What is this person want cancer to know? This person wants you to let you know. They are very unbalanced. This person is a narcissist. The emperor and the queen of swords. What is this person want cancer to know? Oh my god. There's a whole there's so far there's three people here. As you can see, someone in here come as the emperor. You know, like you know. I don't know who's listening to the reading. Someone in here could be um, in a relationship with two women, an air sign and a queen of, and an air sign and a water sign. And that's why this person is come as an emperor. But they are really stressed, really having sleepless night anxiety. I don't know what this person want from you, Cancer, but they come as the emperor. Yeah, the emperor have two wives. The emperor, someone in here is in a polyamorous relationship. They might be married with two women or they have two women. Whether they work with them, whether they're in a relationship with them. That's what I'm getting here, Cancer. That's what this person is going to be black from you. Regardless how they feel, they are going to be black from you because they are unbalanced. What kind of mess is this? What is this person's action towards Cancer? You guys need to raise your vibration. Queen of Pentacles. They want someone in here wants to be with you. They want stability. What is this person attention towards um cancer? What is this person attention towards cancer? Joke. What is this person's intention towards cancer spirit? Four of Swords. 
someone in here wants you they want you to like literally and i'm being telling i'm telling you this like with love someone in here wants you to feel like you are in mental imprisonment they want you to feel like you stuck they want you to feel this is what they want you to feel because they are going through that and i feel like this emperor need to put in their place in this whomever they are dealing with because there's someone in here Four of Swords, this person wants you to feel left out in the cold. That's their intentions towards you. They want you to feel broken because you might be stable. Queen of Pentacles, you know, might be stable. You might be grounded for some of you. And this person, their intentions towards you is to for you to like feeling left out in the cold, feeling broken, feeling like you're unable to move, feeling like you stuck, feeling like you trapped. That's what I'm getting here. And someone in here is they might be very controlling that's what i'm getting but they are black from you so your spirit your spirit your uh spiritual team got your back so you don't need to be worried about anything that's what i'm getting here but some these these people here they're going through their own mess that's what i'm this what going on here let's see their um my goodness let's see their actions they're going to take towards you what is their actions fake someone in here want to making you a love offer what is this person action towards you yeah fake love offer a trickery this is a trick this is a trickery this is a fake what is this person action towards cancer do not believe them let me tell you mm -mm. whatever love offer whatever these people are offer you you see the moon here the moon and the devil Someone in here might be even doing, uh, might be doing magic. So if there, someone in here that's offer you an offer, let me tell you, I don't care where you go. Even if you go, even if you go around anybody, I don't care who this person is. Your mother you trust dearly, your father you trust dearly, your grandpa you trust dearly. Whatever they give you, whatever they if they give you, you said the if now. I'm telling you, because I feel in here, someone in here is might be trying to give you something with the moon here. They secretly, someone in here is trying to secretly sabotage you. They secretly want you to feel like you're going crazy. They might be doing some moon magic, the devil and the moon here. They might be do, even doing magic on you. But whatever they are offering you, if anybody try to take you out on a date, offer you anything, I'm telling you. You tell this person, you know what? I quit drinking cancer. You tell them that. That's what I'm getting. You need to tell this person, no, I don't know, get drunk. I start, I start drinking. But I'm getting the emperor and the queen of swords here, queen of cups. If this person is not, and if this person is not in a relationship with these two women, this person is, oh, they are narcissists. They, they just, this person is like, they are next top level. They are next next top level to narcissists. So be mindful of that. So someone in here, they want you to feel left out in the cold. They want you to be broken. They want you to they, they just want to lay down, just just want you to lay down and like dead pretty much. That's the energy that I'm getting from this person. Wow. So be mindful. Be mindful of people around you, Cancer. Because we have three queens and a king and, and an emperor here. Clarify the emperor, please, for Cancer. Three of Swords. This is someone that is heartbroken. Why is this person is heartbroken? Why is the Three of Swords here, Spirit? The Moon. Some type of secrets here. Whatever this person do to you is backfire. You see the moon. This is the action that takes towards you. But it's also come back over here to them. What is the moon? What is the moon? Some, this person did something awful to you. Nine of Wands. Someone in here could have been, whatever this is and stuff like that, they are trying to block their energy, but I don't feel like they can because they hurt you. It's kind of backfired. The same thing they have done to you is look like it's come back to them. That's what I'm getting here because your energy block from this person. So they're trying, if they try to hurt you, they can't. Let's clarify the moon, please. 
yeah three of pentacles this person want to walk with you secretly you might be refusing you stand your ground you refuse to talk to them they secretly want to walk with you they're hardworking somebody here very persistent they're very determined to work with you secretly they are hardworking three of pentacles this is a collaboration working together that's what they want here somebody here is going is trying to trick you but in the name of God, in the name of Jesus, I feel like that's not going to happen. Especially with your spirit here, it's like, nah, nah, y'all stay where y'all are. This is not going to happen. Let's go find three of pentacles. I feel like that's not going to happen. Yeah, this person is going to be, you know, it, you know, there might be, you know, someone in here. See the eight of swords? They are in their head because they try to put you in your head here. These three people, they could be working together, doing moon magic to making you feel confused, to making you, whatever they have done is going to backfire on them. Let's go for the knight of wands because you stand your ground. Yeah, ten of wands. So they're going to feel like it's a burden because they cannot. I feel like the universe is going to make it very hard for them to do anything to you. Especially, you have a lot of angels, a lot of spirit around you. Because this is ten of wands and nine of wands. It's about action. You know, you have a lot of, this is, you know, taking action. You have a lot of angels make it very hard for them to um, do anything to you here. So I feel like you have nothing to worry about cancer. Nothing the thing clarify the devil and for some of you <laughs> for some of you it could be your family could be a Capricorn for some of you the this you know there could be family involved here that's not want to see you happy what is the ten of cups Yeah, these people are having a hard time. They have they're having a hard time, you know, getting, you know, they might be jealous. I'm getting a lot of jealousy, a lot of envy, you know, people around you, moon magic, try to make you feel like you're crazy. Because, you know, you might have you might have some petty family, you know. I'm telling you nowadays and stuff like that, people are crazy because this is coming as a challenge. Why did justice is crossing the ten of cups spirit? Because they cannot get they cannot get justice. Why is the justice is a challenge for this ten of cups? Yeah, page of wands. People, I'm getting like, you know, someone in here talk, you know, they could have said something in here. Maybe they lie about you. They say something about you here, Cancer. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Let's go for the Knight of Cups. Seven of Cups. Yeah, someone in here might be trying to get you drunk, get you confused. That's what I'm getting here. Try to get you drunk, get you confused. Seven of Cups, Eight of Swords, Confusion. Seven of Cups here. They want some type of, this is about money. Someone in here wants some type of new beginning, financial new beginning with you. They feel like if they, someone in here feel like if they take you out, if they, let me be honest with you. Someone in here feel like if they take you out, they take you out on a date, you know, they give you so maybe some sex here, Seven of Cups. Maybe if they, act like you are um something you mean something to them you will give them some type of financial beginning here but i feel like that don't happen that's what i'm getting here but it's the queen of swords two of pentacles this person is juggling but it's the two of pentacles Yeah, that's what see this person might be someone in here might be they have two juggling jobs someone in here this is about money queen of cups clarify the queen of cups they refuse this person refuse to end a cycle once the wall is um there's a cycle that's end i'm going to put out why to end it there's a cycle that ended but they refuse to let it go this person doesn't want to let it go the wall here yeah the cycle and this person's supposed to walk away they're supposed to move on and stuff but they refuse to 
they would fuse. <sighs> wow. What is the Queen of Pentacles? You get some you get your judgment. You are protected by the universe. What is judgment here for the Queen of Pentacles? Yeah. They mess with you. Someone here mess with you. You get paid. Someone here mess with you. You focus on your work. Someone messing with. They're sitting there like focus on you doing all this, you know, uh, you know, all this shenanigans and stuff like that. But the universe was like, no, wait a minute. Nah. Can't say it's my person. I feel like you might have earth in your chart. This is you right there with the queen of pentacles. But this person, their, their people are really jealous of you. They are trying everything. What is this? What did you try to do when it's come to this king of when it's come to the emperor spirit and uh, spirit? What did you try to do when it's come to this emperor? Because I'm annoyed. <laughs> Seven of swords. So spirit said, don't worry about it. Let us worry about that. We got a plan. That's what spirit say here. Seven of swords. They have a plan. For this emperor right here because i feel like these people someone in here is doing two job the uh, queen of swords is doing two job there might be the management of the group there might be the management of you know the emperor or something like that you know but i feeling like this is might be a relationship not just because there is no cups here but the six of cups and the nine of cups and they're in a negative so excuse me so basically what i'm getting here these people want to work with you because they want financial stability because like i said someone in here this is the trick they kind of someone is look like well six of cups is here, which is that look like something that happened in the past but someone in here felt like you know if they're like taking you out do something with you here that they could have a financial new beginning that's what I'm getting here. And this person is, the emperor is heartbroken, but spirit has a plan. Okay, so I cannot mess with that right there. <laughs> I can't mess with that. But the same thing they do to you is happening to them. They're having sleepless night. They're stuck in the head. They keep you stuck in the head. They're going crazy. So if they are going to try to make you go crazy, they're also going crazy. So if they try to put you down, they are also going down. We turn to, uh, they're going down. We turn to senders. That's all I'm going to say for you guys. They hang one. Spirit say you enlightenment. Just be patient. Just, you know, move forwards and stuff. And you're going to be fine. So, Cancer, this is your reading, honey. That's all I have for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video. This was a spiritual lesson. Trust yourself. Trust yourself. Bye, Cancer.